Hi everyone, I have a package opening. Um, I know I said I wasn't going to do any more dolls, but I'm kind of um, really into the cyber uh, smart dolls right now with the cyber markings. Um, I have passed on a lot, but um, I kind of am definitely one of those hobbyists who like to collect all the different versions. So um, I'm not by any means going to get all of the cyber dolls, but I would like to kind of maybe have all of the different colors of the cyber markings. So I have um, these two here, which gosh, now I can't even think of this one's name. I don't remember. Recky maybe? I think it's Recky. Yeah, it's got to be Recky. Um, so she's in gray and she has the like silver cyber markings. And then I have Cleo here and she is obviously Coco and she has the gold markings. So now I have another cyber girl hair that I purchased through Fabric and Friends um, in the retailer in the US for a smart doll. And I'm just going to open her up and show you which one I picked out. And then, oh, I hope that it doesn't wobble too much. I'm just, I actually am sitting up, sitting outside in my backyard where it looks, the clouds look pretty ominous. <laughs> As in, well, it's pretty gray skies, and we're supposed to get rain, but I'm just gonna try to do this as quickly as I can, but it's still probably gonna be a little bit longer video because I have um, some other little packages that I wanna open up along with this uh, smart doll. So I'm hoping that it won't rain on me while I'm doing this, but I am underneath a tree, and I hope also that the outside noises are not too super loud. Um, I have like a wind chime and there's birds and there's wind and my air conditioner is going so hopefully it won't be too much. This is the order form or the order invoice from uh, Fabric and Friends and I'm just going to kind of flip that aside because inside is the smart top box. So Way too much. Um, just standard smart doll box, and I'll just tell you what it says. There's little stickers right here. Let's see if I can zoom in for you guys. Can you see that? It is Cyber Shell Timeless and Cinnamon. So it's not so much that I want to get um, like a different skin tone for each smart doll, though I would like that for the cyber. But I think actually the cyber, the different color cyber markings have been put on specific skin tones and correct me if I'm wrong if anybody knows that but I feel like all of the gold cyber markings have gone on to cocoa silver has gone on to gray and then with cinnamon they were doing the like black brown but now I think they've changed it to the purple I think or they haven't released a new version I don't remember. I, I feel like I saw something about what the next um, cyber markings would be on cinnamon. Maybe it is the purple, but I would like to get a purple cyber doll in tea so then I can have different skin tones as well as the different cyber markings. I feel like I felt a sprinkle. <laughs> I'm not going to start writing yet. So here's the um, smart doll bag. It's still in uh, one of the older ones because this, I think, Timeless hasn't necessarily been discontinued, but um, if they're going to re-release her, it's going to be in a different skin tone or a different uh, cyber market color. All right, well, <laughs> it is trying to rain. I am slightly protected here under my tree because it's, you know, full of leaves and everything but I might have to cut this video short if it starts to rain really hard. I don't know, and it's really windy. I hope this video is not super hard to understand, although I know a lot of times that happens for me anyway. Uh, so inside the goodie box is her wig and a stand. <laughs> it's really starting to rain, I don't know. Hopefully it's not like messing with the video too much. 
I thought the lighting would be better outside, but um, I don't know. This might not be the best choice because it is starting to rain. I'm going to take my chances, you guys. I'm going to do a video in the rain. Hopefully the leaves will keep me protected. Alright, so I'm just going to shove this box back in here so it doesn't get too wet. And I'll shove this box back, or the bag, underneath the table here so it doesn't get too wet. <laughs> you guys probably think this is the most silly video I've done yet. So here is Timeless. You can see right through the bag there's very nice um, I think they're just black markings. That's what it is. It's not black brown. It's just like a nice black marking. Um, but it is the same cyber markings as on the other bodies. Same design. Um, the only difference would be in the markings on their faces. Alright, let me just shove this under the table here. I'll set her up so you guys can take a look at her. get this under the table so it's not being rained on too much all right so here she is you can see the markings there on her body and there is her really adorable face so this would be the first like I guess full cyber doll I don't know how to describe it because the other two cybers that I have are the prowess so they have the whisker markings as opposed to like these line markings on the face. Oh my gosh. Stuff is blowing away, you guys. Oh no. It's all gonna stay up. This is an adventure, you guys. Okay, hold on. Not the end yet. I got this. It's a little windy. All right. I'm gonna pop her wig on, but I'm probably gonna have to... Oh no, I don't think I'll have to take her... All right. Uh, <laughs> so this is timeless, you guys. I'm gonna do this fast. I have a different... Oh, like a little swimsuit for her instead of her undergarments because one of the things that's in these little packages here is a necklace <laughs> i hope it's okay that she's getting rained on right out of the package oh my gosh this is terrible <laughs> all right and i thought maybe i didn't know if this would be because this was from the retailer uh or the vendor maybe she might be on the Gen 2, but I don't think any of the Gen 2 dolls were cyber. I don't remember. I don't know. Um, I did uh, do a video for this outfit before. This little swimsuit is kind of Little Mermaid-ish, which kind of conflicts with uh, the cyber. But at the same time, it's going to show off all her cyber markings and not hide them. So that is why I chose it real quick. Okay, it is definitely raining, <laughs> but we're still hoping for the best. All right, so swimsuits uh, are definitely a good thing for cyber dolls. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so being like ridiculous out here. <laughs> Thankfully, I chose a good spot, so the tree is mostly protecting me. All right, don't mind her flashing, everybody. I'm just gonna put these little swim trunks on. And we can still see her really great cyber lines, her cyber markings. I would be really beyond excited to get a uh, pear girl with the cyber markings. And I know that we've seen that a few times um, on the Twitter or X account or whatever. Whoops, she took a dive. There are her feet, everybody. <laughs> All right, this is difficult. I'm trying to rush and not get rained on and it's okay. She's okay. She's all right. I'm going to pop her wig on, which is just a short brown wig. Um, I don't think I have the wigs that came with either of these two girls on them, like their original wigs. Um, Cleo, the Coco, I actually didn't get her as a full set because um, you might notice she has only like the four whisker marks as opposed to the six that the current Cyber Prowess are coming out with. Um, oh my gosh, Timeless is really 
really beautiful. She does have the like gray blue eyes. Um, I'm hoping I can pop her wig on here fairly easily, but it's definitely, you know, the nice form fitting smart doll one. So you kind of have to give it a good tug. All right, did I do it? Make sure we can see her cute little eyes. She's like, okay, you put me in a mermaid bikini. Does that mean I have to go swimming right now in the rain? <laughs> uh, okay. Um, interestingly, I'm having a hard time getting her head to bend forward, but I guess it is. Okay, so her eyes are kind of covered, but she looks pretty cute. I like her. And I think she goes really nicely with the other um, cyber marking dolls. All right, now I have these last couple of packages and I'm really getting rained on. Can you guys hear the rain? All right, let me open these things and then we'll, I'll be done. I'm trying to do pretty quick here. So, um, this might be, oh, this is so cute. Okay, so this is from an Etsy artist. My Crystal Dollhouse, this is my second order from them. And on the back she wrote a cute little note. It says, thank you for buying another Smart Doll item from me. I appreciate your support and your review. I included, oh, it's getting rained on. Oh, goodness. Your, I included another necklace for your Smarty. Uh, and it's from Jenna and she included this cute little Mirai sticker. I'm going to put that away so it doesn't get rained on too much. This is a really, really cute blue, like navy blue and stars dress. It's very cute and form fitting. It's for the classic body. Um, I don't think I'm going to try it on either any of these girls, although it might have looked really good on her. I, I didn't remember that this was what was in here. So here's the cute little necklace that she included. It's not bouncing around. It's like a cute little diamond gem on a gold chain which goes very nicely with the stars and stripes kind of thing. And then here is the dress. It has a tie top and kind of that sweetheart neckline. It's really cute. I'm hoping, I'm gonna leave this girl in this kind of like, you know, 4th of July getup and I'll put somebody else in this. Um, I just think it's so cute. It looked really adorable on uh, her model that she had in her Etsy store and so I was super excited to um, purchase this from her and kind of have a 4th of July look for some of my Smarties and thank you for the really adorable necklace so that is super cute and we'll definitely do a dolly dress up for that later my girls are still getting rained on they're like what is going on here all right this I think this is what I had for um, in mind to go along with this little mermaid bikini this i believe i think oh my gosh i didn't even open it what is going on here cut it open there we go maybe nope that's just the label that i just ripped off it's still sealed all right let me try again you would think i would know how to open up a package by now after all the packages that i've opened in my life in this hobby. All right, here we go. It says, thank you. And it is a little necklace. I got this from an eBay seller. I don't believe she has an Etsy, but she has several um, jewelry pieces designed for smart dolls. Um, sorry, I'm getting distracted. I'm hearing one of my favorite birds flying around. I just saw them fly by too. We have a pair of red-tailed hawks that are living in our neighborhood and especially in our yard. And I think I just saw them fly into our snag tree. All right, so here is the necklace. I know it doesn't kind of look like much there, but you see a little pearl. So it's like a little seashell with a pearl in the seashell. And it's purple and it has little purple and pink beads. Let me see if I can get you guys close up here. Isn't that really cute? I think it's really, really pretty. And I thought, well, if I'm going to put on one of this, one of the dolls to wear this cute little necklace, why not give her 
a little a full-on mermaid look so there you go isn't that adorable a cute little thank you bag so I will put a link to the Etsy or the eBay seller um, in the description of this video of course along with my crystal dollhouse um, and then there's just one last item and then I gotta run inside because it is definitely raining now it's not like pouring <laughs> but it is a steady rain you guys recognize this logo that is the doll clothier on Etsy I am a pretty regular shopper with them <laughs> I will be saving their little sticker for my sticker book um, this is just something I, I kind of went shopping one night because um, I was feeling bad about <laughs> about my hobby and just whatever so I just went shopping and I bought this shirt for my one and only smart doll boy or I shouldn't say one and only I have one smart doll boy body and I rotate three different heads on it and they're all different skin tones so the body is cinnamon and I have a cinnamon boy head but I also have a cocoa boy head and a tea boy head and I just got them this little gamer shirt I think it's pretty cute of course the girls could wear it too it would fit them It'd be like a little bit looser but that's okay that is it you guys <laughs> so I opened uh, timeless cyber shell with the black markings purchased from fabric and friends I'll give a link to them too um, I opened the navy blue and stars dress from crystal dollhouse on Etsy this necklace from the seller on eBay I'm sorry I don't remember the eBay seller name but I will definitely link to them and then the boy t-shirt from doll clothier so these are my cyber girls now let me just squeeze them all together so you guys can get one last look at them they're super cute let's see if I can get her to look a little bit more into the camera and there I am in between um, I'll have to come up with a name for her I don't know I was thinking something along the lines of something to do with time since she's um, timeless um, but that is it you guys thank you <laughs> so much for watching um, I really appreciate it I hope uh, this video is helpful please reach out comment or whatever if you're interested in any of those sellers or just click on the links in the um, video descriptions have a great day everybody and I hope this video was not too much sound overload with outside sounds have a great day. Bye.